Michael, 39-year-old Shamir Terry was killed by Deputy Christopher Williams and Deputy Christopher R. Scuderi while in the middle of an attempt to rob a Circle K. Today, Sheriff David Davis held a news conference giving his thoughts on the investigation, and as of now, he stands with his officers. An armed robbery suspect is now a deceased victim after attempting to flee the scene of a crime he committed. We have witness uh, uh, that has had some indications that uh, that uh, Mr. Terry had fired some shots uh, behind the store. Uh, that's all being investigated. The GBI is now looking into it. 39-year-old Shamir Terry was killed by Deputy Christopher Williams and Deputy Christopher R. Scuderi after firing shots at them outside of a Circle K he had just tried to rob. Uh, in the final moment when this person uh, uh, points a weapon at him in a menacing manner, that they, uh, they have to take a, a deadly force action. Terry, who had warrants in multiple counties out for his arrest, was rushed to the hospital but later died there. None of us, no deputy, no law enforcement person goes to work thinking that they're going to take a life. And you do everything you can not to have that happen, but, uh, you know, your training and your mindset uh, kicks in, and so you do what you have to do uh, given the circumstances that you're presented. But With the pending investigation of officer force in motion, Sheriff David Davis says he believes the two deputies followed proper protocol. You never know what an investigation reveals, but from what we've seen uh, the, uh, of, the, of the evidence so far, from what we've uh, talked to witnesses and just the circumstances that presented themselves, uh, the deputies had to do what they had to do. Davis says the outside investigation conducted by the GBI is just standard procedure and will hopefully tell the truth. Right now, the GBI is waiting on the sheriff's office to send over body cam footage from the two officers, dash cam video and surveillance video of the Circle K to continue reviewing what happened. The two officers are on paid leave until the investigation is complete.